Good morning, children. As today in these days, we people all are facing with the lockdown system. So we DAV teachers, we are sending the lectures, we are sending the learning material through some videos. But today, some of the students they have called me and they are facing some problems in the first chapter of class eight, mathematics. Chapter's name is squares and square roots. Some students they are facing the problems. So I am here. to sort out your queries first sum which i am getting from most of the students that is the square root of 363609 let us start how to solve first of all uh, let us start to make the pairing you know we have to start the pairing from the ones digit in this way now first of all first pair is 36 with us 6 6 r 36 now 36 minus 36 it will be 0 now it is a turn of the next pair we have to take here 36 again and again here it will be 6 and 6 it will be 12 and let me start the rough column also rough work Twelve. I cannot take any digit here so that I may get the number less than thirty six. So what I will do? The same which we are doing in the division. It is not divisible. So first of all, we will mark the zero here because it is not divisible. So let us take the next pair also. That is zero nine. So now I am having one two zero. That is one twenty, and I have to replace one digit here so that I may be able to get the number either equal to three thousand six hundred nine or less than six hundred nine. And it seems to me that it will be more convenient for me if I will place three here because three threes are nine, three zeros are zero, three twos are six, and three ones are three. So I will place three here. Three here and three thousand six hundred nine, and my remainder will be zero. It means answer will be six zero three. I hope so. Your this query is sorted out. And children, don't worry. My number is mentioned here. If you are having any problem, you can call to me on this number between eleven a.m. to two p.m. Next. One more sum is there, which the most of the students they are asking. That is the square root of fourteen lakh seventy-one thousand three hundred sixty-nine. Right now, again the first step to make the pairing from the ones digit. See my pairing, how I am doing. Only one is left here. So my first step to divide one. So it will be one ones are one. Now again, I'll take the next pair that is forty-seven, and one plus one it will be two. So I know. Uh, let me start with my rough work also. Two, and I want for less the number. Less than forty-five, forty-seven. So it will be twenty-two twos are forty-four. I'll continue with two. That is forty-four here, and seven minus four it will be three here, and it is a turn of the next pair now. That is thirteen. Twenty-two plus two it will be twenty-four. I can see now three hundred thirteen means I have to place one here. So it is two forty-one, two and seven. And it is a turn of the next pair that is sixty nine. Now two forty two, and let me see which number I can place here so that I'll get the number equal to seven thousand two hundred sixty nine. It is nine. It means let me try with three. Three threes are nine. Three twos are six. Three fours are twelve. One carry forward. Three twos are six and one seven. Oh yes. Done means I'll place three here. Means answer is one thousand two hundred thirteen. That's all. 
children i hope so your queries are sorted out but even then if you have any problem you can call to me and be ready i will be very soon with you with my next video that will be related with the square root of the decimal numbers thank you have a safe day